Good morning everyone. I'm back here at Port Barton in Palawan here at the Airbnb that I put up in 2018. If you watch my earlier videos on that, that was actually one of my first videos. It's my first time back here na it's actually back operating. Um, we are also starting to get some guests here at Nelman's Nipa Huts. Unfortunately, the town is not yet back as it was pre-pandemic. So, medyo slow pa rin. So, uh, medyo kulang pa. It's not yet back to where it used to be. I actually wanted to chronicle this. See also, ano nga ba yung ginagawa ko dito every day before. Uh, now, it's a little bit less because it's not as busy. But also, I'm more busy with doing my Airbnbs in Manila. I'm gonna be continuing to do that even from here. Hopefully, I get around to do some editing as well today. And context also is, this is partly a vacation. This is uh, half a vacation, half working. I wanted to show you what my life is like here. Um, at the end of life, like they say, So now it's about 10.30. I uh, spent probably the first hour and a half, two hours uh, working on the uh, reports that I needed to do. Um, we want to head out for coffee already. Uh, but before that, uh, I wanted to show you the property here. So um, I'm showing you this room now. So this room was... Uh, one of our other rooms before, pero since uh, nung bumagyo nung December 2021, the same typhoon that ravaged Siargao, so um, it wasn't as publicized but Palawan also was badly hit. I've had the other rooms renovated already, pero ito hindi pa kasi, you know guys, additional cost. <laughs> um, and just as a trivia, uh, si Jumping Places, Chris and Carol, they actually stayed here when they had, I think, a few thousand subscribers. Uh, that was back in 2018. We arrived at our Airbnb. So this place is called Nelman's Nipper Hut. You can see here we have these cool other little huts that people stay in. I actually ended up meeting them um, during the pandemic when they went to Manila. Actually, they're one of my inspirations why I put up this vlog in the first place. Okay. Um, so where I'm showing you now is the other room. So we have a guest coming in this afternoon. The cleaner just finished uh, putting this place together. So um, as mentioned before, so the place we put up here in Port Barton is very no frills. Actually, Port Barton as a whole is really a backpacker place. Um, very chill, very different from El Nido that is uh, very fast-paced, busy, so many tours. Dito sa Port Barton, there are also tours, but it's not as pressured, I guess, if you can call it that. Uh, there's also a cozy balcony that you have uh, for two of the three rooms that we're renting out anyway. So let me bring you to the coffee place that where we're gonna have some espresso. So there's only one place now that's serving espresso. Um, and then I'll show you a bit around Port Martin also. So are you guys excited? Out to get coffee, kahit super in it. Ice coffee. Ice batay jan. So we're here at Milano Cafe. So this is a place that actually closed before during the pandemic but I'm glad they're open again.
brunch lunch um punta kami muna dito sa beach uh, yeah. work can we a little bit um <laughs> So it's after lunch. Um, so instead of heading back to the hut, so we're here now at this new hotel called Holiday Suites. I'm waiting for a few things to clear up. So Airbnb, sa Manila, some cleaning and waiting for the guests to check in. So I'm gonna be sending them the check-in instructions in a bit. So for this part of the whole Airbnb process, at least I can. Do it remotely, do it here from the comforts of this um, lovely hotel. So it's about 2 p.m. Um, I'm done with one of the two check ins at uh, BGC today, so. Uh, I'm almost done. I'm um, just waiting for a few things uh, para I can swim already. This is what's waiting in front of me. Um, I'm just waiting for a few more minutes before I go here. Um, just a little bit more uh, and I'll be swimming soon. Yes! done with my quick dip this afternoon I still have to work on a few things so I'll probably be heading back to the hut now so we're headed back to the Nipa hut um, like I said this is half a vacation anyway so back at it um, trying to finish a few things before mag sunset it's just gonna be another two hours or so like Boracay it faces west so magandang sunsets niya. Um, especially even after sunset, so we'll bring you there later for you to see how we end our day uh, with the sunset. So we're now back here at the hut. It's a little before 10 p.m. I know it's early, but um, for a sleepy town like Port Barton, um, that's pretty much how we'll call it a night. Um, I hope you enjoyed um, seeing how I live my day here at Port Barton. Um, I hope you've enjoyed. Um, you've seen us with our night out also briefly. Um, and that's about it. Um, if you've liked this video, please don't forget to like, comment, and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Thank you again for watching, guys, and see you again next time.